Hi, my name is Darby James. Something shocking about me is that my mother's name is so similar to mine that the people always mix up our names. My mom's name is Davy and my name is Darby, so they sound pretty similar. We even have the same middle names. Our names are both really pretty, like, unique and different. I think that I'm the most perfect person capable of talking about myself because I know myself the best, obviously. So I think this is worth listening to because I'll be talking about myself. After this speech, you will know me better and understand the kind of person I am. The goal of this speech is to understand me and the things about me. I may not be the most interesting person out there, but I will share with you the things that you may not know and may surprise you. Today, I'm going to explain an important event that happened the day of my birth, my interests, and my goals in life. By the end of this, you will have a pretty good idea of what I will be doing in my near future and understand my lifestyle. I was born May 10th, 2001 in Ames, Iowa. The only thing I really know that happened on my birthday was, well, of course, my birth. I've never really thought about anything else that could have happened on my birthday, but I looked up my birthday and what news happened on that day, and I found some pretty interesting stuff. I found that on May 10th, 2001, an article about banning cell phone usage was while driving premature was banned. I think that this is like a good thing to, that could have happened because like this action causes many accidents and so many kids do this nowadays on the road and we need to give our full attention to the road at all times for safety of ourselves and other people. Now that you know something that happened on my birthday, another topic I can talk about is my interests. I haven't really been involved in much that made me happy when I was little. And as a kid, I was involved in a lot more sports, but they just really didn't spark my, like, enjoyment. And now that I'm in high school, I've found things that I really love to do and truly, like, make myself want to participate in them and give my full effort to. My first interest that I've loved to do ever since I was a kid was dance. I was involved in many dance academies throughout my childhood and loved every minute of it, from the sparkly outfits to the makeup Everything about dance makes me happy, and I'm so glad I'm involved in the Owl Falls Alden dance team through my four years of high school. This team has always been my dream as a little girl, and I'm so glad I decided to continue my career in dance. My second interest is teaching Sunday school at my church in Alden. I have always loved being around kids, and I'm so thankful I was asked to do this job because I love my church, and I'm so happy to be helping them out and teaching these young children about Jesus. Um, I teach first, second, and third grade kids, and the kids I teach are so sweet, and they listen very well, so it's pretty easy for me to enjoy and like. Now that I've shared with you my interests as a person, now I can tell you what my life will look like in the near future and what my goals are as I become an adult. My goals in life are to have a steady job and be able to eventually start my own family someday. I plan to later attend DMAC in the fall and to become a dental assistant. I've always struggled when trying to think about what I want to do for the rest of my life because that's such a big like decision to make and I feel so young. So I think that this job would be fitting for me because I have had lots of experience like at the dentist and I've never really hated going to the dentist. So I thought why not try this out and it would keep a steady paycheck so that I can later raise a family. Um, sometimes I think that I would make a better teacher, but since I love like teaching children so much and I have so much experience with Sunday school, but as of now, I'm just going to stick with dental, but if I change my mind, I will change to be a teacher. I grew up in a big family. I have three brothers and a sister. I love being around my family and having my siblings to hang out with and be able to look after. This is something I've like always wanted ever since I was a kid, watching my mom like take care of five children. I've just always looked up to her for that and wanted a family of my own. And ever since I was a kid, I've been playing with baby dolls. And as I said, my mother is such a great mom, and I hope to be able to raise like, a big family as great as she did someday. You know, now you know more about me and my personality. I may not seem like the most interesting person ever, but I hope you think I'm not as boring as I think I am. Now that you know an interesting fact about me that happened on my birthday, 
and the day I was born, my interests and my goals in life. I hope you can understand the type of person I am and why. I was born May 10th, 2001. I love to dance and teach Sunday school. And last of all, I can't wait to start my journey next year in becoming a dental assistant and later starting a family. A quote that I want to leave off on this is from Jeremiah 29, 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and hope. I love this verse because it reminds me of like that my future is protected and is in God's hands and just not to get so worked up about the little things and just keep going with my life. Thank you for listening.